This story only on K2 Now. A patriotic symbol stolen from the front of Vancouver woman's house. She flew the flag in honor of her late father and for the 9-11 anniversary. K2's Megan Kalkstein is live in Vancouver. And Megan, she's got a message for whoever did this. Yeah, Steve, in fact, if you walk by our house here, you really can't miss that message. Take a look. It's hanging right there. It's a little hard to read, but it says, You stole my father's World War II American flag in honor of 9-11. Shame on you. She hopes whoever sees that message will bring it right back. In this Vancouver neighborhood, American flags are everywhere, but you couldn't miss the one hanging from Marguerite Houghton's home. And it was an enormous, beautiful, beautiful flag. To give you an idea of just how big it was, the flag, similar to this one, was 10 feet by 7 feet and covered almost the whole porch. It came from to the end of there to over here and hung all the way down but you don't let a flag touch the ground. But it wasn't just big, it also carried a special meaning. And it meant the world to me. Houghton was given the flag after her father, a veteran. A World War II, and he was a gunner. Passed away 15 years ago. She only brought it out twice, once when 9-11 happened, and again on the 10-year anniversary. So I proudly hung it up again. I even nailed it all the way across, hoping nobody would take it. And it was up there for six days until Saturday morning. That's when she noticed someone stole it. Why would anybody want to take an American flag? To me, it's, it's, it's a sin. It's so wrong. Now in its place, Houghton hangs a sign showing what she says is disbelief at the disrespect for those who served, the victims of 9-11, and her father. This made me heart sick. This was something that belonged to me. It was very personal. And a part of my dad, I can't get back. Houghton hopes that whoever took the flag will simply just leave it somewhere here on her property. She says that she will forgive them if they do that. But she also tells me that she has filed a report with Vancouver police. We're live in Vancouver. Megan Cockstein, K2 News. I want you to just hope somebody has a heart here and just brings that thing back. It means so much to her, uh, Megan. Thank you for that yeah. tonight.